Jan? Hi. Hi, honey. What's going on? I'm starving. I so might go out to lunch with Antonia. Oh, that's nice. What are you doing? So we're gonna go on the shop, me and the girls. Awesome. Yeah. Well, Margaret's got a book deal, and she's doing it with Emily, my ghostwriter for all my books, Standing Strong. Oh, I loved her. We're going on Emily's yacht. That's good. Yeah. Hi, Gia. Love you. <laughs> That's Daddy. Oh, he's voice texting. Like, yeah. Why? It's so creepy. Hi, Gia. Love you. It's so weird. Like I reply, like I type. It was that. Cause I saw a girl. I thought maybe that was his girlfriend. No. Oh. Do you have a picture of his girlfriend? No, he just he introduced me to this girl. Oh. Wow. Well, we were like just like on FaceTime, just talking, and he was like, "Do you want to meet the girl I'm on I'm at dinner with?" And I was like, "If you want." And he was like, "Well, no, 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 only if you want." He was so scared, like he was actually in his pants. <laughs> like it was so funny. And I was like, "No, Dad, it's it's okay." Yes, honey. Go. All right, I'm gonna drive you to soccer. I'm gonna take. Oh, is that Dad? Yeah. Hi. Hi, Gia. I heard Gia met your girlfriend. <laughs> I heard Gia met your boyfriend. <laughs> Are you kidding me? It's not a bad thing. Yeah. Dad's dating. Like, you can date. Okay. Yes, I'm dating someone. I didn't talk about him because I wasn't ready to talk about him. Your parents are so happy for you, Teresa. Love is in the air. Do you have any names, letters? Hi. <laughs> I guess people have loose lips. That was good that you made um, G and me your girlfriend. She's my lawyer, not my girlfriend. But he's yeah, dating and her. You stop being defensive. Like, yeah. you guys both date. Well, you said it was okay for me to date, right? And it's okay for him to date too. <laughs> what? I guess I can't keep it a secret forever. But if it's going to get out there, I'd rather people find out when I'm ready for people to find out. Trust me, this is all new for me. You know, like I just want to do everything right. But I appreciate the green light. That's it, I'm going out every night. No, we can't. <laughs> <laughs>
music change the channel, bitch. Okay? I do. It's my I don't tone. even speak that way. It's my tone. You're, you know what, Jennifer? Your behavior is very Because you're saying, like, like, oh, you don't know how to read the room. You don't know you don't. how to read the tone. You don't. You don't know how to read the yacht. You don't know how to read the yacht. <laughs> yacht. By the way, are you still with your boyfriend? Huh? Did you, like, break up? I'm not Are you talking taking about a break? That. I'm not talking about that. You know, Nani, she never wanted to talk to me about, like, anything. Like, she didn't really talk to me about, like, boys and, like, sex. Um, well, I'm serious. For her, don't well, where you Where are you going? You haven't had sex yet, right? No. Your cousins told me you did not. Why are you asking my cousins? They just tell me information. Why do you need to know information about my life? You're my <sighs> daughter. Are you kidding me? Are you Talk kidding nice. me? So, yeah. I know you're very mature. I'm not trying to act like you're a child here. But I need to know that you know that you can get pregnant, number one. You understand? The hell up. No one should ever, ever touch you without protection. There's STDs. Please, enough. No, no, you have enough. to, I have to say this. Please stop. I think this talk could be a little bit more successful. Okay, you can laugh at me all you want, but you are gonna hear what I'm saying. I mean, I'm trying here. <gasps> you have big boobs, big boobs. And I don't want anyone ever telling you they want to see them or touch them. Stop! That's a problem, and, and, and like, I need you to know how to handle um, yeah, that. I have to pee for about 50 minutes. I mean, at the end of the day, I hope I got my message across that if you're ever thinking about doing it, like, you could come to me. You need to be strong enough.